As a teacher, data collection is important to make data-driven decisions about student learning. Teachers use data collection to prepare for delivery of instruction, provide database decisions within grade level meetings, and to meet students where they are. Robler and Hughes, 2019. In my district, we all have our assessments on the computer or iPad that collects our student data and divides them into subgroups and proficiency groups. When working with teachers and analyzing school-wide data, it is important for me to use spreadsheets, such as Google Sheets and the Google Apps for Education Suite, to ensure that I am collecting efficient data to make data-informed decisions for all the grade levels that I work with. I take the data that is entered into the spreadsheets and create pivot tables in which teachers are able to see how their students performed on each standard that was assessed in class and can see the groups of students who answered the question correctly or incorrectly. From there, we can make data decisions for reteaching and remediation of concepts through the pivot tables due to being able to see which students need additional support with the standard. Pivot tables have become a major part of my data collection in my role as an instructional coach because I can see individual grade level and school-wide data to help inform curriculum decisions and instructional strategies to address the needs of our learners. As I work with teachers to help analyze data, I use the programs that we have been provided to analyze individual students' needs and researching the resources provided in the program to help create intervention materials for our students. The main program that we use to assist with our data collection and analyzation is Ames Web Plus by Pearson. Through this program, students are assessed on a variety of measures in reading and math. Some elements of the assessment are timed while others are open-ended responses that students type their answer or show their work through a drawing. Once the assessment is complete, we analyze each measure and the graphs are created for our students to see where they are performing in comparison with their same age peers across the nation. We share this data with students and they each have a data collection notebook where data is collected through benchmark assessments and progress monitoring probes to constantly track student progress and intervene when necessary. Students from kindergarten through fifth grade can chart their progress and interpret these graphs to see their growth and create goals to align with their progress. Charting and graphing are tools that can be used to visually represent data analysis and the skills incorporated with charting and graphing are beneficial to students in school and in their future careers. Robler and Hughes, 2019. Data notebooks provide students with specific and individualized information about their areas of strength and areas of improvement. It has been researched and stated that data notebooks help students collect and analyze their own data to give them a voice in their learning and how they can work towards success. Weirda, 2015.